Hey guys, so I am currently in the bathroom because I am about to wash my hair. Um, and I was just showing you what my hair looks like before I get in the shower. Like, yes, it is like poofy and messy, but it's still like pretty defined and stuff. I don't know if you can tell, but it's pretty defined still. It doesn't look horrible. But yesterday I did go to the water park, so that is why it's frizzy and puffy. But overall, like, it looks good still. Like, it still has, like, a lot of definition. So, I was like, I'm going to re um, record what I did to my hair that has it looking good with this definition. Because I didn't record it the last time I did it. But I um, basically did the shingling method. method. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to record it for you guys. So, you guys can see what I did and how I got really good definition. Um, yeah, so if you're interested, keep on watching this video. Look, my bitches all bad, my niggas all real. I ride his dick in some big tall hills, big fat checks, big large bills. Burn out, flip like 10 car wheels, cold ass bitch. I give raw chills, send it for looks, and my lips all kills. I kiss him in the mouth, I feel all grills. Heat in the car, that's my on wheels. Woo! I was born. Okay, so before you get in the shower, I'm not recording my uh, wash routine because I've done that plenty of times so you guys go back on my channel and look for those if you are interested but I'm going to show you the products that I've used last time because I'm going to use the same exact products this time so um the shampoo that I use is a new shampoo that I'm trying out I've only used it for the first time the last time so I'm going to use it this will be my second time using it but it is the John Frieda um sheer blonde lightening shampoo because I'm trying to get my hair a little lighter. So hopefully this works after I bleach it or whatever. So I don't have to re-bleach it. So I'm hoping the shampoo works. And then I'm using my um, main choice pink lemonade and coconut conditioner. You guys know I um, live off of this line. The main choice, the pink lemonade one. Um, this is the gel that I use for my hair. It's the um, wet line extreme styling gel. I use that and then my leave-in of choice was my um, cream of nature pure honey leave-in conditioner um, so yeah and then I had a um, wide tooth comb um, for detangling in the shower but uh, yeah that's about it so yeah I'm about to get in the shower and I'll see you guys when my hair is washed and conditioned Okay guys, so <clears throat> I'm back. Um, I'm out the shower, my hair is wet and detangled. As you can see, um, if you guys have watched my previous um, washi hair routines or whatever, you will know that I, you know, section my hair into four sections to um, wash my hair. So that's why it's like this. Um, so now um, I'm about to take my leave-in spray. Um, and spray that all in my hair um with my demon brush and then i have my uh gel and what i'm gonna do since it's like in a bottle like this i have um another gel container over here that i'm gonna use to um put the gel on basically so i can just you know dip it in my dip it on finger and you know use it so so, um, yeah, I'm about to do that real quick. I'm going to pour a good amount because I have a lot of hair to do. Uh, last time when I did this, last week, it took me an hour and a half to do my hair. So, yeah. Good thing you guys don't have to wait that long. <laughs> you can see it in a couple of minutes. So I'm about to just take my hair and pin it up out the way. Um, so none of the sections are like in the way or whatever. I'm start back here. Spray a good old generous amount on my hair. And then take my brush and brush it through. 
Last time I put um some oil in my hair, but I don't think I'm gonna do that this time. But yeah, it's not gonna make no difference. So yeah. And then within this section, I'm going to take smaller sections to work in to shingle it. All right, let me get a little, get you guys a little closer if I can. Come on, work with me. All right. So this is my hair with no product in it what it's looking like so I'm going to take a little bit of gel on my finger come on a little bit of gel on my finger and I'm going to rub it in on this whole section all on the roots and everything smooth it in And go all the way down. Alright. And then the long part is going each curl. Like I literally don't go about exactly each curl because that'll take even longer. But uh I do take really, really small sections and just smooth the gel on to my, uh, what I'm trying to say, my curl. <laughs> All right. They look straight because I'm not doing anything else to them. I'm just like smoothing the gel on them. So it's just weighed down by, you know, gel, but, uh, They'll curl up when I'm done. And I'm sure this isn't the proper way of doing it, but uh, this is how I do it. And it's working for me. My hair came out how I liked it, so. It's good enough in my book. Oh, this section is too big. Oh, da, da, da. So as you guys can see, this takes a long time with just me doing this little bit of hair. Where is that section I just dropped? With this um little bit of hair. But um it does have a really nice outcome, so All right, so this is how it's looking for now. Not all the way dry, so some of them are still like not curling all the way up, but it's okay, it'll get there. But this is what they're looking like for now. So I'm about to do the rest of this section. I'll do it um, on camera, sped up. I can start. I'm trying to take you guys out. Sped up for a little, and then I'm just gonna cut the camera off because I'm gonna be here for a while, and then I will come back when my whole head is done. So.
so this is my final uh product how it's looking very very defined the how to say definition and defined in one word <laughs> very defined very very defined as you see in the back hopefully it was in good view but yeah so i'm loving my hair super super cute again i use the um extreme styling gel this gel is like this is the junk this is this is the shiznit <laughs> um yes yeah, so that's what i used so um uh i'm gonna let my hair air dry and then after i'm gonna take some oil and like uh scrunch it up on my hands so uh it gets rid of like the you know gel cast like i could break the gel cast so my hair isn't like so uh dry crunchy like even though i personally don't care about that as long as my curls look good don't know i need to be touching my hair anyway but um yeah so after like i said it air dries and i'm gonna go ahead and use some gel and just scrunch it on my hair like that and um yeah, then that, that'll be it, and I can style it as desired. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want more um, videos like this, if you like this type of video, make sure you give it a thumbs up so I will know. And um, I can make more natural hair videos for you guys, because I know it has been a while since you guys got one. Um... So yeah, make sure you let me know down in the comment section and by liking this video. And um, yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. And I love you guys. Mwah.